Hey, what's up everyone? Saints fan back again with another GTA 5 video and we're doing a car show. We haven't done one of these in quite some time. So if you guys like these car shows, if you want to see more, then definitely drop the video like. That'd be much appreciated. But we'll go ahead and start with this side since there's less cars on it. And what I told these guys, it's pretty much an any car car show. So to bring any, you know, their best cars. But if they have a really cool like gun running car, I will appreciate that a little bit more. So hopping in, let's go ahead and grab our flashlight. We have this person right here, the GTA boss. He's rocking the Miami Vice Cheetah. The Cheetah Classic looks so freaking beautiful, man. I love the, the sort of simple design he went here with the, just the all white. And then I believe you have, you did change the rims up and you put white on the interior. But yeah, I, I just, I love this car, man. It looks so cool. Next one, we have another Cheetah. We might see a lot of Cheetahs because this one is the most recent car, but this one has a beautiful blue color here with a really nice pair of or set of white rims don't believe those are stock but we have the white on the sun strip there to sort of match and the creamish color on the interior moving along we have the zentorno this one is a car that uh, obviously has been in the game for quite some time and he's rocking it in the super dark blue here with the neon lights and he's got the the black rims there Black, that dark blue and, and black go really nicely together. I mean, it's a Zentorno, so, I mean, it's going to look good, but it's just, you know, it's a little old. Then we have the final one for this row. Ooh, what is this color? This is a Cheetah Classic here with blue as the secondary. And then a, I guess that's a wine red. It kind of almost has some blue in it from this side for the primary. And then you have the red on the interior, the sun strip there with the stock rims pretty cool not a huge fan of the the crew emblem there but uh, i like the colors then we'll go ahead and move way down here to this person's wagner and he's rocking it with the orangish yellowish color and black you know fairly simple i like how you match the rims with the color or the you know the primary then you have yellow, it looks like, on the inside, and, and obviously that looks really good with the black, and especially the black tinted windows. Next one is the Masakro, and this one has a really cool blue color. It's really nice looking. I don't know if that's a crew color, or if that is a just a regular blue with maybe a white pearlescent, but it looks really, really nice. And then we did skip this guy since he's coming in late. He's rocking... The T20 with the chrome paint job, which looks really cool at nighttime. It's got that nice, like, texture to it. And he's got the, the darker pink on the chrome and then the lighter pink on the secondary with the black tinted windows and the black rims. I kind of like that. But again, it only looks good at nighttime. Moving along, we have, ooh, this Cheetah Classic. A little crazy with it, but I kind of I kind of dig it, man. You got the blue with the white, and you went all out with the white. You got the white crew logo, the white rims, the white spoiler the white stripe white interior and even the white neon lights so definitely a little crazy but you know it looks good all right so i gotta i'll give you that one then we have the fast and furious car skyline from this guy right here and obviously the the sultan rs is probably my favorite car still in the game so i'm always gonna like it and i really like the uh the customization you went with here the that blue Stripe there, matching the blue underglow. Looks pretty cool. Moving along, we have a super freaking bright green Nero. Green and black, color, a good color scheme here. But uh, that is super bright, especially when you shine the light on it. Like, <laughs> I don't know if, I think that's a crew color. I don't think that's lime green, but you know, it's not bad, it's not bad. Here we have the LG Retro car I haven't seen in quite some time. I like this car, man. I feel like it's an uh, underappreciated one. It, when it came out, there was a lot of hype behind it, but I haven't really seen it too much lately. And he's rocking the the all-white edition, which I think looks really, really good on it. I mean, you have the white rims there, the white underglow. You have black on the inside with a little bit of white. But yeah, that's a good look. Here we have mine, and this is Vice City Blue. It's a little bit beat up, but we have the Cheetah with the Vice City Blue, which is probably one of my favorite colors for this car, just because of how simple it looks and we have the the beige or brown on the interior the white stripe with the white sun strip and then i believe it's just like you know the dash vip rims on the wheels so fairly simple not too much to it but i, I really like that color next one i guess uh this is technically a vehicle that you can add to your garage from joe hands we have the apc tank 
and he's rocking it with the giant cannon or missiles on top with the green camo so definitely a forest style paint job but uh you know not really much to it i like it though and then we have this guy's uh we have johnny's cheetah with a really nice i think that's a i'm pretty sure that's a crew color i don't think that color you can get in the game and then he has the black to sort of go or to contrast that super light green i really really like that like the black on the rims on the windows the black stripe down the middle the black on the spoiler back here and even on the engine and then you have white on the anterior to give it some you know pop that's that's honestly a really really solid look but that is the cars at nighttime there actually might be a few more down here that we'll go ahead and look at but we're gonna go ahead and switch it to daytime and check out some of some other cars uh, during the day but this one is the Wagner he's rocking it with a beautiful silver I don't know if that's a metal if that's just a regular silver but that's that's a really good look nice and simple and then this one is the Nero with all blue <laughs> little crazy you got white on the interior but you got all blue for everything else so those are all the nighttime cars. Let me know in the comments which ones you think look the best, but let's go ahead and hop into daytime. All right, so now we are in daytime and we have some new cars. So, and I'm gonna quickly go through these because there's a lot more now and I don't want this video to be super long. So the first one, we have the Sultan RS with the blue, the darker blue, or actually is that gray? It might, well, no, it's a darker blue from this side with the white. I kind of like that. It's kind of like a, a faded color scheme there. I think it looks pretty cool. It's definitely different from all the other ones. Now, this guy somehow freaking got the Insurgent Pickup Custom, and he's rocking the whatever camo that is with some, I think that's Armor 2. I'm not entirely sure. But, uh, yeah, he's rocking the Insurgent Pickup Custom, which is not even in the game. So he's a freaking hacker. Moving along, we have the Weaponized Tampa, and he has the yellow and black tiger. That's what I call it. Uh, color scheme or livery. Obviously, he has all the armor on, which is kind of dumb how the armor is not, like, it doesn't really help. It, like, it doesn't protect you from more explosives. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But, yeah, he's got that, which is, you know, I like it. I like it. Then we have the Wagner. He's rocking the red, white, and black. Really simple. I like that look for the Wagner. Moving along, we have the APC. Now, he's got the uh, traditional sort of tank or cannon on the top there with the red and black nice and another or another sort of super simple one we have two back-to-back -back sort of simple ones here but i like that like whatever red that is and the black i think they look really well together on on the apc now we have another sultan rs here with a super simple gray paint job with a little bit of a darker action no, that's carbon on the hood i kind of like that again you know i like these cars that are a little bit different than what you would normally see so that's cool here we have a cheetah from this person and he's rocking the all blue i think is this the guy with the freaking all blue nero do you just have like i think that is him man he's freaking just he's he's he only likes blue apparently moving along though we have another cheetah and this one is an all white version with the white sun strip you have black on the inside black tinted windows regular chrome rims there with the white paint job so another really cool one uh, I'm pretty sure we already did that one in the freaking nighttime car show. This is mine. You guys have already seen it. The Spectre. Really like it. Then we have the Wagner with the chrome and mint green color. So, eh, chrome isn't my favorite, but mm, it's not horrible. At least with the doors up. <laughs> Probably like worse with the doors down. Then we have this freaking guy's car, which is, is this modded? I've never seen this. What the hell's going on with this guy's roof? I don't know what that is. But he's got the, I think this is the Saber Turbo Custom. And a really cool color. Like, I like that color. But I think that's modded. Because, like, what the hell's going on with the roof? Uh-oh. What is that giant shadow? Oh, God. We have a freaking Hydra. This might not end well. But we have the Duke of Death here with the yellow and red. Darker red. I kind of like that. Colors go pretty decently together. Then we have the Vapid Trophy Truck with blue and white and then black not really much you can customize on on that one moving on to another Wagner this one has the lava red you have the red and the orange with the black which you know that's a pretty solid color scheme they go well together here we have the green Wagner as he steps out Ooh, I like this color that's actually a pretty good look I like the uh of course it's gonna start raining 
but we have the like the the lighter green, I guess. I don't really know what you would call it, but it's different. Now, speaking of not different, we have the lime green <laughs> Wagner with the uh, the black. So, hmm, seen it before. Then we have the LG Retro with the black and the blue, I believe. We go ahead and move out the way. Yeah, black and blue. This is a good look. The, the it's it's really simple. You did go a little crazy on the rims. Maybe take the white walls off the rims, but uh, yeah, I like the uh, the black and the blue there. That looks really nice. Then we have to sort of wrap it up here, a uh, a graphite color, I guess you would call on this bag. This is actually probably one of my favorites from today. The graphite with the that like darker red. That looks so so good. That dude, that's definitely one of my favorites. And then we have the Cheetah Classic in black and red, which honestly is a color scheme I haven't really seen on the Cheetah Classic, but to be honest, it's not half bad. I don't know if that's actually a black or if that's just a darker silver, but that's actually pretty good looking. And then let's see, is there anyone else? I don't know if there's anyone else. Someone said they were gonna bring their mobile operation center, but I don't I don't know if they actually did. <laughs> But uh, yeah, those were all the cars. Those were the day slash nighttime car show. So hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, again, please drop the video a like. I think there's one final one we'll go ahead and look at. It looks like it's an X80 that is black and white, perhaps. Looks like it's black and white. Or cream. Cream and black. Which is a good look with that white pearlescence on the cream. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please drop the video a like. And let me know in the comments if you want to see more car shows. Since I haven't done them in a while. But thank you all. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.